everybody and welcome to our channel. Welcome to our grand suite on board Royal Caribbean's Jewel of the Seas. <laughs> um, I had to think then what ship we were on. Yeah, we're on Jewel of the Seas. We're on a seven night sailing out of Cyprus to the Greek islands. Currently, this is day one of our cruise. We're heading towards Athens where we're due to dock tomorrow. And it's also a big day for Peter. Yeah, it's another, another year on, yeah. <laughs> another year older. <laughs> Um, so we'll be in Athens to celebrate that. We don't, we haven't got any real plans to do anything in Athens, but it's kind of, we don't think the weather's going to be too brilliant in Athens tomorrow, especially in the morning. Hopefully it'll brighten up. Um, but we'll probably venture into the city and explore. We've been there a few times before, haven't we? Yeah. Um, but we like the placa area of the city, which is more traditional Greek, um, almost like a little mini city within a city. Um, as I say, we boarded yesterday, we flew from Manchester to Larnaca, very early start, our alarm went off at 3.30am, which was a bit traumatic, um, so we were quite tired by the time we finally got on the ship. It was a four and a half hour flight, slightly delayed leaving, um, then we obviously we had to transfer from the airport to the port, which was another 45 minute coach drive. Yeah. Uh, and then we had to go through the testing procedure, which went quite well. Yeah, it did actually. I was quite surprised because um, I registered prior to uh, setting off uh, using the app and then they scanned the QR code, did the test. Uh, we walked around the corner, did our formal check-in then, and we'd already done checked in online. So they just scanned the set sale passes that we had. Uh, and then they called out the number and uh, confirmed the QR code. They put a sticker on the back of your passport and uh, off you went. And then you handed your passport in because they're going to hold those for the whole week. Um, and then we finally boarded the ship. So it was a bit of a long day though to actually get here, but it was worth it in the end. Yeah, and uh, I think we got on about five o'clock-ish. Something like that, yeah. Yeah, yeah. We, and we left port about eight. Um, yeah. As I say, when we left, we were up in the concierge club because mm -hmm. that's uh, obviously one of the perks of being in a suite and um, we ate in the main dining room last night very good uh service was good staff were good um we had a late night snack didn't we <laughs> yeah <laughs> well you see we missed out on during the day because we didn't eat anything from breakfast yesterday morning which was about 6 a.m yeah um, until dinner last night until dinner last night so we think we justified it after we had a few <laughs> drinks yeah <laughs> so we yeah we went to the there's a little cafe in the solarium to sell sort of late night snacks so we just popped in there before we went to bed um this morning we went to went for breakfast in the chops grill another perk of being in a suite is that we can have breakfast in one of the speciality restaurants um it's probably the food's probably not that different than you'd get elsewhere it's just no. it's a quieter more intimate atmosphere not too busy so that was quite nice first thing in the morning with a nice sea view yes uh so today we are going to explore the ship we're gonna venture off uh, filming and recording and just seeing what's going on around the ship there's lots of activities that seem to be going on yeah if you looked on the app um so we're looking forward to doing that so we will see you later bye 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 <laughs> Thank you. 
Concierge Club. Um, we're just having a pre-dinner drink before we head to Giovanni's table. Yep. Which we're eating in tonight. It's former night, so we're you can see we're dressed up. These are looking very dapper. Um, we've had a very relaxing day. Not done a lot today. No, no I even had a snooze this afternoon. I think this yesterday's early morning start caught up with me. Um, but it's been a lovely day, lovely weather. We're just sailing. Uh, as I say, towards Athens, we get there tomorrow morning. We'll see what we'll do tomorrow. We've not got any real plans. I think we might get up a bit later because we're in port for about 12 hours or something like that tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, I think we get there at 8 a.m. and we leave at 8 p.m. So we've got plenty of time. So we'll just get up, see what the weather's like, uh, and then venture out to explore the city. And I'll try a bit more on my new gadget that we've got. Oh yeah. The Insta360 Go 2. Yeah. Um, so apologies for any of the ones that I do at the moment, because they're not very good, but I'm getting there, I'm getting there. He's being modest, they were very good, I thought. Um, as uh, I've got my little Osmo pocket, so I was uh, mooching around the ship today, filming. We passed each other at one point, didn't we? On the I college? know, but mine wasn't <laughs> working then. Oh. I, wave, I waved at you and you waved back, but I've not got that recording. But I think I've got it recorded the other oh, right, end. Okay. So we'll, uh, as I say, we're, um, we're enjoying a few drinks. Joe. <laughs> a few drinks, uh, and then we're gonna head to Giovanni's table shortly for some Italian Italian food. Yeah, Italian. Yeah, yeah. It used to. What did it used, the Italian used to be on these ships? Well, it is Giovanni's. No, oh, no, no, for, Portofino. Portofino, which Portofino. we love. We used to love their their jumbo shrimp. Oh yeah, yeah. Thing, uh, yes. But uh, I'm sure Giovanni's will be great. So you can tell we've had a couple of drinks. <laughs> um, but uh, we'll see you tomorrow with a, a little tour of Athens, no doubt. All right. Bye bye. Bye bye. So, Mr. Horton, how was your meal in Giovanna's table this evening? Absolutely excellent, honestly. We ate there before, but tonight was absolutely beyond wonderful. Yeah, the, we had very hit and miss in Giovanna's before. Very much so. Um, but tonight, honestly, from the starter, which was a sharing plank of, of meat and cheese, yeah. to the, the uh, uh, next course of, of pasta. Oh, the pasta was unbelievable. Oh. You had the tagliatelle? Carbonara. With a poached egg on top. Oh, unbelievable. And I had the bolognese, which was recommended, and it was truly awesome. And then I had the filetta di manza. Which, which is a steak. Uh, it was... Sublime. It was the that best steak was. we've ever had on land or sea. Honestly. It was just amazing. And the ones we've had recently over our UK <laughs> CKs, we blew it out of the water. Yeah, and then we weren't going to go for dessert because we were a bit stuffed. No, we did. <laughs> you even ate half of mine. Yes. And my birthday tomorrow, I can uh, do. Yes. Anyway, we've had an amazing evening. So we're in vintages now, uh, having a few bevies. Just the one? Or two or three. <laughs> uh, well, we don't know where the evening's going to end. Last night I ended up in the safari club singing don't. karaoke. Not, yeah. not us, I would add. Uh, actually, no, it ended up in the solarium having a jeer off. Oh, yeah, I don't know what time <laughs> that was, but it was very nice. Uh, just to say, we've had a lovely first day at sea. It's our first proper cruise post-pandemic. We've had a few out of the UK, but they're not really visiting anywhere. 
So tomorrow getting off the ship in Athens and exploring is going to be a great treat for us. Um, but as I say, good evening to you and we'll see you again. Look at this. What? <laughs> this. Are you enjoying your Chardonnay? Yes. <laughs> We're in the schooner bar. We've just been karaoke, not us karaoke, in, in the Surrey Club, but we're now in the schooner bar. Enjoying a very good piano singer. And um, my excuse is, it's my birthday. Yes. Happy birthday, Peter. Thank you. How old are we today? Not saying. <laughs>